how do you define masturbation for yourself presume that in every life you know so, there comes a miserable phase and people start masturbating for you know 3 to 4 times in a day do you think so it has that's true and what you have had the experience with your life or what do you mean hi miss mary hi how are you i'm good i'm good so far so good how about you i'm good thanks for asking what's your name uh this is vikash shukla vikash nice to meet you and where are you from uh i'm from india from india is that where you're calling yeah. from sorry sorry is that where you are right now uh delhi yep yep from india delhi Very i nice. hope you know about something about india i don't know much i'll be honest can you teach me uh, something ex uh, there is nothing actually but yeah one thing i would share here right now like uh, india is very famous, famous for the diversity, diversity you know for, for, for the for its, its own culture, culture. and it's, especially when you visit india, india you are going, going to love you know the cuisines the, the, the different kind of uh, foods that, that you are going to taste especially the street foods i mean it's very delicious that, that's, that's a short introduction of india, india. <laughs> What's good to know? What kind or what is like your favorite type of food? I mean, I'm a vegetarian, so you know, like uh, it's normal having chapati and uh, pulse rice kind of things. I mean, there's no, nothing because I'm 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 very concerned about my fitness, so I don't love you know. Uh, but of course, I can say one thing: uh, pizza is a, is one of the favorite uh, pizza. Good, you can. You yeah 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 yeah. Nice. And what do you like on your pizza? Hmm. Uh, lot of I don't know because it's it's spongy. The first of all, and the second, the cheese and you know kind of onions is uh, uh, means uh, slices are there different type of, and that's that's really very scrumptious. I mean, it's very luscious. Hmm. Very yeah. nice. That's good. I do also love pizza. <laughs> really? Yeah. Cool. And I like pizza, pasta. I like. um like beef uh like burgers or steak or like chicken even um i don't know i like a lot of different things i also like tacos and burritos uh-huh. it's the mexican burrito. yeah yeah would you mind if i if i uh like today i have already made up my mind for one topic that is something i'm using mostly i'm using this camly app you know to just get over from my unknown fear of speaking in front of anyone with mm-hmm. any topic Things. Oh, sure. So the today, the today topic which I made is something quite interesting. I don't know if you are comfortable with that. We will go with that. Otherwise, we will move with the other. So it's it's masturbation. Okay, an interesting is, is topic. It, is it is it okay? Because I do have some questions, so I'm gonna pop some questions to you, and uh, according to your own thoughts, you can answer those questions. I mean, those very normal questions. That's good question. Okay. <laughs> We can try. Ha, huh, exactly. We should be giving the try. So, okay. let me move forward with this topic. All right. So, masturbation. So, the first uh, the first question I'm going to ask, how do you define masturbation for yourself? I mean, what do you believe believe for this masturbation term? Um, I would I feel like I would just define it as like pleasuring yourself. I don't mm-hmm. know, I like that's really the only that- definition that I would I would give uh, any creative like any 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 other thing that you you believe that uh, okay just just uh, answer me in, with this a uh, question is masturbation good or bad if i ask you in a direct way it depends on the person i mean depend on the person uh, basically what uh, uh, like masturbation isn't bad i i think so i mean i i bad for the person do you think so No, I it's very it can be bad. Because I believe it's it's really a self love, you know, as you said that it's it's a kind of pleasure, self pleasure. So provided that you shouldn't be addicted of that, the first thing. Um uh, otherwise it's definitely like there is nothing kind of uh, harm effects or aftermath of this uh, masturbation. Do I make sense? Yes, I think I did. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So um all right um the second question is that uh, i believe you know i presume because um, have had all the experience in my life and met different kind of my friends and all the ones so what i've got that is uh, 
in every life like i presume that in every life you know so, there comes a miserable phase and people start masturbating for you know 3 to 4 times in a day do you think so is, is, is that's that's true and what yes. you have had the experience with your life or i would say probably not i wouldn't i wouldn't think that, that would be true i feel like that's a lot in one day especially mm-hmm. when people work 9 to 5 and then you know what i mean i feel like that's too big a number i don't know if that's accurate and how about the young people like especially those who are not working from morning to night you know being in the college life and uh, uh, just giving money just giving all the time into kind of things what can you say of those person <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I <laughs> miss you already have been through such phase in your life. I mean, you have you might have had the experience of all things like uh, in encountering different people, you know, and just uh, maybe Yeah, I mean, I would say I know a lot of people that do um mostly like men um mm-hmm. and I don't yeah, I don't really know I don't know. Okay, all right. So masturbation is especially categorized as a or or characterized as a you know male's activity. Mm-hmm. So is it true? <laughs> is it true? Because I mostly because when, I, when I when I open the Google, you know, when I open the Google and just trying to figure out about the everything, then it's very astonishing to you know find out that even the all like most of the girls are participating in kind of things like masturbations, you know, and all this stuff. Do you agree I- with me? I think Indeed. some women do. I just think women don't talk about it as much or they aren't open about it whereas men audibly talk about it. But why why it's happening so? Like why this kind of insecurity does a, a women have or a girl have? Because it's a nature phenomena. I mean I don't I, very... don't I just I just for some reason men are just So what do you feel about yourself? Do you even possess the same things, the same attitude or something different? What do you mean? I mean, just I'm asking. Like, uh, even you feel the same thing. Like, you do not never discuss with your parents or something, some uh, someone, or having same kind of, uh, you know, fear of discussing with people. Uh, not really, but it's still just something that you don't really talk about. I guess for the most part. Uh huh. So, but in English culture, I I have I have heard that you know the things are very frank and people used to. Op- openly talk with the things and uh, especially when it, when it comes to india of course like uh, uh, it's it's very i- inappropriate you know it's a taboo to talk about these kind of things it is never being told and said in front of anyone in india exactly in india even you cannot talk with anyone i so that's still a thing you still don't talk about it uh but nowadays i i have to agree that that people are evolving like they are just uh, you know creating the awareness and uh, discussing with their parents or something uh, with the with the pa- uh, friend uh, i mean with the children and that's really good actually because it's a kind of normal thing and we should be discussing with with all the ones because as you know there are a lot of websites uh, where the people especially the young generation are are uh, accessing those websites you know using or consuming those content in a bad way and it affects it affects their mind in a bad uh, in a bad way actually so that's very awful actually i believe what's your take on this on, on what specific i mean just like uh, is this topic should be like highlighted with everyone's you know the parent even should be discussing about uh, with their children even they should be making awareness you know about in the society about these kind of things i don't think you should be talking about it with children um i mean not children you know what does it start from 13 14 ages and even the uh, you won't believe i mean when you see now uh, the the boys who are uh, the girls who are 14 15 start watching porn videos and kind of sexual content so it's it's become mandatory task you know it's very vital to start speaking with them because at the early age they would they would understand when they become once they become habituated of and you know they start lis- listening to their parents i mean that's very normal yes although i do think it's that would be a challenging thing to talk to your children about um cuz often exactly. they're religious i mean cuz you 
you have to talk about sex and whatnot, but I don't really... directly, but indirectly, you can you can uh, give a reference to that. I mean, I guess, yeah. Because, 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 you know, in in education system or in schools, th these things are not being taught. I mean, even the teachers are, you know, having uh, feeling very uh, frightened while discussing these things with the children. I think it just depends on the school system and the education system and how they. The system is same actually. The system is same. How about your education system? Because in our India system, education is is very boring. You know. Uh, we never talk about the things. Of course, there are kind of topics like sexual reproductions and in, in bio, but especially like for just one, two days, they, they, they discuss the things. But I, I believe, you know, sexual kind of topics are very important topics because uh, we just uh, give all the life into it and it has a big, big, big role in everyone's life. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does. I mean, it's important, definitely. But yeah, I mean, we just learned about it in school. Um, yeah, I think they started teaching us in like fifth grade. So, All right. Yeah, but we have um, less than a minute. But oh yeah, yeah, we have forty two seconds. I feel like you you weren't feeling comfortable while talking or discussing about this topic, but still, it's okay. You said it. Uh, I was just answering your questions. Okay, I got. It. I, I I can sense that. All right. Uh, still, I appreciate it. The answers that you have gave because very consciously and you have really thought about it and after that you responded it so yeah. thank you so much ma'am uh, for giving you time and i appreciate that thank you i hope you have a good day you too you too you too thank bye. you bye bye bye, bye.